Dongpirs are a mutational vampire species, born only, but rarely, when a vampire has sex with a pure human man. Due to their origins, as well as their human-like appearance and behavior, they are the closest the MGE setting has to a genuine half-human and half-monster being. Despite their parentage, Dongpirs despise the arrogant vampires and make it their life's mission to vanquish them. Which here of course means defeating and then conditioning vampires to treat humans as equals so they'll have lots of sex. A sudden mutational variant of the vampire. When a vampire has sex with a man before he becomes an incubus and conceives a child, these monsters are rarely born. They have an open-hearted personality, which is the polar opposite of a vampire. They don't look down on humans, and they honestly express their fondness for the men they like. Though they are actually completely monsters, they are also regarded as half-human and half-monster. Their appearance is extremely close to human, and they possess demonic energy that gives off an aura similar to that of a human. Although they have the monster's values regarding love and pleasure as supreme, and considering lasciviousness a virtue, they also have basic common sense human values. For that reason it's extremely easy for them to conceal their true nature and behave like a human without anything feeling off. Many Dongper prefer to live in human towns. They don't attack human men. Just like a human woman, many of them go through the normal stages of romance, etc. Before being joined with a human man. But as for that. Because they are born with supernatural beauty and also possess human values. They can use many tricks to charm human men, and it's difficult for the men they go after to escape from them just like it is for any other monster. It is said that the men who become their lovers or husbands in this way only finally realize that they're not human after tasting otherworldly pleasure during sex. The demonic energy that the Dongper possess robs strength from vampires almost like sunlight, and has the power to steal away their reason and capacity for thought in the same way that garlic does. Most of them fundamentally view things from a human perspective. And for that reason they despise vampires who act arrogantly and look down on humans, and it infuriates them when humans are mistreated as servants. For that reason. If such vampires are around. They'll use the magical power and superior physical strength inherited from their mother to vanquish them. And through discipline and training they'll correct their arrogant, stubborn personality and change them into open-hearted women who can honestly express their love and fondness of men. Of course, in the case where their mother wasn't honest with their father, a Dongper's first target will end up being her own mother. After that, many of them journey as vampire hunters, vanquishing vampires while searching for a husband. Additionally, since the servant, husband, is involved during the training of the vampire, they sometimes grow fond of him, and end up becoming his wife along with the vampire. In this way, Dongpirs will not only injure the pride of their race, but may also become a rival for their husband's affections, so they are truly feared as the vampire's natural enemy. Furthermore, they are sometimes attacked by an urge to suck blood in hair, although they normally resist it. The reason why is if they happen to learn the sweet taste of a man's blood. The human part of the half-human. And after that they can't resist future urges to suck blood at all or the lust that visits at the same time. 